Here's your daily dose of history. These events happened on June 28th. In 1519, Spanish King Charles I, grandson of Spain's King Ferdinand II and Queen Isabella I, and also of Holy Roman Emperor Maximilian I, is elected to succeed his grandfather and is crowned Charles V, Holy Roman Emperor. He secures the needed votes by bribing German princes, helping him beat out other formidable candidates like England's King Henry VIII, France's King Francis I, and Saxony's Duke Frederick the Wise. Frederick goes on to undermine the emperor's rule by supporting Protestant reformer Martin Luther. In 1861, Robert O'Hara Burke and William John Wills, leaders of an expedition that explored inland Australia from the south coast to the north coast, died during the return journey 10 months after their famous expedition began. The exact date of the explorer's death is unknown, but June 28th is the date fixed by the Exploration Committee, which commissioned the journey. Despite help from ab Aboriginal tribes, monsoon rains and dwindling supplies play a major role in their deaths. In 1914, Austro-Hungarian Archduke Franz Ferdinand and his wife Sophie are assassinated in Sarajevo, Bosnia-Herzegovina by a Serbian nationalist, sparking the outbreak of World War I a month later when Austria-Hungary declares war with Serbia. The assassination may not have happened at all had the Archduke's driver not made a wrong turn, which put the car just a few feet away from assassin Gavrilo Princip. In 1992, a 7.3 magnitude earthquake and a 6.3 magnitude earthquake strike the desert east of Los Angeles, California within hours of each other, causing $92 million in damages, injuring 400 people and killing three individuals, including a three-year-old child who is crushed by a chimney that collapses. The quakes trigger landslides that wipe out roads and also open a 44-mile-long crack in the earth, the biggest in California since the famous 1906 San Francisco earthquake. In 2006, Daimler Chrysler chairman Dieter Zetsche announces that the company's city-focused smart brand, which is already producing popular tiny cars in Europe, is coming to the U.S. in early 2008. The brand began in 1994 as a joint venture between Swatch, the Swiss company known for its colorful and trendy plastic watches, and a German automaker, Mercedes-Benz. In fact, the name Smart is a mashup of the words Swatch, Mercedes, and Art. U.S. sales of the Smart car are initially promising, but they soon begin to decline. Eventually, Mercedes-Benz announces that 2019 will be the brand's final year in the U.S. market. Please remember to check out Today in History in my Teachers Pay Teachers store. There's a link in the description. Which of these events did you find most interesting? Let me know in the comments. Also, please be sure to like this video and subscribe to my channel. And there's another great Mr. Lewis video right here and another one right here. Thanks for watching.